All right, if you're new to the channel, thank you. Um, if you're just watching, please hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, share the video. Um, basically how this works is we're gonna draw three winners that commented on last week's Wheat Penny giveaway video. Um, three winners are gonna win what we found last week, plus I always add things to it. YouTube is not a part of this giveaway, void, Pro void where prohibited. Must be 13 years or older to enter. Um, so we're going to give away this Reaper 3 nines fine copper round with all the wheat pennies that we found last week. After we draw the three winners now, then I'm going to hunt a box of pennies and then comment on this video and that's how you enter for next week's video. I know I'm butchering this all up, but real quick, um, got three winners here. I wanted to share something that Christopher Watt sent that you guys will greatly appreciate. Okay, Coinman 5000, here are three Guam West Point W quarters for your weekly wheat scent giveaway. I know that in some areas, people still haven't found any West Point quarters yet, so I am giving you three of the quarters from my collection, basic collect, to give away. Keep doing what you do for the community. Christopher W, Christopher Watts. Christopher Watts, super awesome of you, my friend. Look at this, guys. The West Point mint mark, see the W? He's giving away three of these to you guys. That is super awesome, my friend. Um, you guys definitely give Christopher W a big shout out. Uh, that is super cool. Let's go ahead and add one to each of these. So that is really cool. So three West Point quarters. Also, I'm gonna add some silver. So we're gonna add a 1936 Mercury Dime to first place winner. That's a 45. I think this is a 40. Yeah, 1940. It's 90% silver Mercury Dime. And a 45 Mercury Dime. So this is going to give somebody a pretty decent little jump start on the collection if they're kind of new to collecting. If not, I'm sure you guys will greatly appreciate it. So let's go ahead and go to the YouTube comment picker. 153 unique comments. Like I said, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and make sure you comment in the comment section down below. So let's go ahead and pick first place winner. All right, congratulations, John W. It says, congratulations to the winner and thanks, Coin Man, for the chance to win. You are welcome, my friend. Make sure to email me your mailing address so I can get this prize out to you. First place winner. Second place winner is Brenda Lee. It says, good luck. Congratulations, Brenda. You are the second place winner. Third place winner is... Silver Fun Green Thumb. Congratulations, Silver Fun Green Thumb. He says, I love Friday mornings. Your prizes keep getting better. I never win, but congratulations to the winner. I saw the Canadians also and eventually try to put together a set. Love how you put the mintage up there. Few decent finds anyway. And love the Silver Shields. You're a rock star. Keep doing what you do. See, you said you never win and you actually won. So awesome, Silver Green Thumbs. That's really cool. Glad you won, my friend. My email address is right there, if I remember to edit it in this video, which I should. But anyway, um, we're getting ready to hunt a box of pennies. Hopefully we can find some wheat pennies to give away for next week's video. And I got something special in mind to give away, so uh, definitely check out the video and watch it to the end. Like I said, you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Make sure you comment in the comment section down below, that's really important if you're watching this video. And hit that like button. Um, share the video also. That'd be super cool. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get started. All right, got a $25 box of pennies here. Gonna hunt this box of pennies looking for Indian head pennies, wheat pennies, uh, proof coins, any kind of errors or varieties. Also, I separate all my copper pennies, so I save all my copper ones. Those are pennies dated um, 1982 and prior. But all the wheat pennies or Indian head pennies we find in this box is gonna get donated to somebody that comments in the comment section down below. So let's uh, check it out, see if we can find anything good in here. All 
All right, found our first one. It's like a 1951 Denver. Not too bad. All right, hopefully we can find some more. All right, very next roll. We have got a 52 Denver. So two Denvers so far. We'll take it. All right, we got another one. And it is a 53 San Francisco. Nice to see the S Mint mark show up on the board. That'll work. All right. Not bad little gouge there in the uh, wheat lines. Is a 54 Denver. Still a wheat penny, we'll take it. All right. Actually a really good looking wheat penny here. Pretty clean other than some bag marks, but uh let's see what we got. 58 Philadelphia. We'll take it. Alright. All right, another nice looking wheat penny here. It is a 1950 Denver. It's a lot of 50s, hopefully we can break that habit there of getting 50s. All right, got a really nasty looking one here. Really gross. It is a 53 Denver. All right. Congratulations to whoever wins this one. He is a beauty. All right. Not too bad. A lot better than that other one. All right. 1952 Denver. Almost looks like some brain matter, matter there behind his head. But uh, we'll take it. Alright. Got one here that looks like it's cleaned or dipped or something. So let's take a look at it. Pretty shiny. 1945 Philadelphia. Like I said, it just looks like it's cleaned or something's going on with it. Not exactly sure, but uh, whoever wins it, they can investigate it. All right, another decent one here. I'm too shabby. It is a 44 Philadelphia. That'll work. Love the 40s. All right, look at the gunk on this one. Yikes, 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 yikes. All right, it is a 51 San Francisco. We'll take it. All right, so not a too bad of a box. Got quite a bit of wheat pennies, or not wheat pennies, uh, copper pennies here. Let's go ahead and throw them in the copper bucket. They went pretty good there. That was a good, good box for copper, that's for sure. All right. All right, so we hunted that box of wheat pennies. Let's go ahead and see what we're going to give away for next week's giveaway. So obviously all the wheat pennies we found there. And in lieu of it being close to Halloween, let's go with the, uh, the feast dollar. This is zombie 
Zombux. Check that out. Isn't that pretty cool? It's in an airtight. Kind of making fun of the peace dollar. This is called the feast dollar. It is Zombux, currency of the apocalypse. Three nines, fine copper, one ounce. In a beautiful airtight to protect it. So that's going to be first place winner. We're going to go ahead and hook up second place winner also. And look at that. Kind of a really nice proof like finish. That's going to be second place. And then third place for next week. And then if we get any mail calls where somebody's giving stuff away, so we'll add some stuff to it. But here we got, this is what the giveaway is going to be next week. So obviously all you got to do is comment in the comment section. Be a subscriber. Hit that like button. And if you don't care, share this video, would you? That'd be great. I'd greatly appreciate it. All right, everybody. Well, good luck and thank you very much for watching.